Hi everyone, this is DJ. Welcome to my channel. If you have an LG TV with WebOS and you want to set your TV to power on to one of the HDMI inputs instead of the home dashboard like you see here, then in this video I will walk you through the two steps you need to take in order to do this. So without any further ado, grab your remote and let's get right to it. All right, now the first thing we need to do here is we need to go to all settings, not just the regular settings. We need to go to all settings and you can do that by pressing and holding the settings button on the remote, the one with the gear icon over here. Now, if you press and hold it for a few seconds, you're going to see on the screen the circle coming right up and now you're in all settings. In here, we're going to go to the left and go down to general. Then we're going to go over to the right, scroll down and go to system. Click on there. In here, we're going to go to additional settings. Click on that. And then go down where it says home settings. Click on that. And in here, where it says power on screen, select that. And then select recent input. Click on there. And that's it. Now you can press the home button on the remote. And next, we need to go to home dashboard. Right over there, click on it. Now in here, if you have a specific HDMI port or even if you have a, like an antenna and you wanna and you want the TV to power on to that right away, all you gotta do is select which one you wanna do. So let's say if I wanna do shield over here, right now it's HDMI three, I can click on shield and that's it. Now, one thing to keep in mind here is that if you turn off your TV and this is the last input you use, that's the one that's going to power on to. If you went to HDMI 3, then it's going to power on to the HDMI 3. All right, so now that we selected that, you just got to click on it again to launch it. So now you're an HDMI 2. So if I power off my TV, give it a second. Now that it's off, next time I press the power button again, and it Powers back up. As you can see right away, it says HDMI 2, and you're back right over there. And that was it. Pretty simple. If you guys have any questions, please leave it in the comment section below, and I will answer everybody's question as soon as possible. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. It does let YouTube know you like what I do here, and it does help my channel grow. Thank you for watching. This is DJ. Till next time.